Welcome back to the channel. We'll continue our questing in Assassin's Creed Origins. Let's get exploring. So we're going to continue our quests. We're going to go through these. So we're going to do family re reunion today, and um, then we'll get on to the other two in the next couple of episodes. So here we are. Going to find the target and reunite him with his family so off we go running 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 now i would have used my camel at this point but <laughs> yeah i forgot which button it was so we're just going to run across the landscape and we've got to find the temple where the gentleman we're going to rescue is being held so it gives you a little bit of time just to have a look at the landscape might give you a little bit of music while I'm doing this. Senu up and we'll have a wee bit of a fly around so it's the first time I've used Senu and um, yeah it takes a little bit of getting used to it, it doesn't steer as well as I thought it might but it um, doesn't take long to get used to it though so we're gonna up we go where are we we're at the temple fly across and when you need to zoom in just use your left tailor and it will identify people now <laughs> in any kind of game that has this um, option I never ever get everybody and um, I'm sure this will be no different so what we're looking for is we're actually My looking wife. for Terramon and the farmers that are with Terramon, so we just got to fly around until we locate him. It's a big area though, it's a big, it's a big temple. Fantastic. Actually, we do like this option. It's, um, it's quite different for Assassin's Creed uh, game. But um, you'll see in a later uh, episode, I do have a few issues um, actually getting the eagle to go up. What, what I'm finding at this point in time, and maybe I need to have an ability to, to improve this, but what I'm finding at the moment is that you've got to be in a reasonably close proximity to the place that you're going to enter for to let Senu come up, and you'll see in a later quest. Um, Senu isn't always the right option for you, but I'll say no more than that. So, it's just a case of just flying over. Try to identify as many people as possible. Now, like I said I'll miss people. Always do. But, but, so, I'd advise if you're using this, just to take your time. It might take a while. But it's worth taking your time because then, then at least everybody's clearly identified, and you don't run into any surprises like we're about to do. Oh, 
Is that the target? Yep, yeah, we've got him. Yep, yeah, we've identified who we're looking for, so that's good. So let's just fly over there and check out who's around. And then we'll get, get jump in and see if we can go and find him. So as you maybe can tell, I'm a little bit impatient. I just like to, I don't like to be at the action too long. So I tend to just get, run and get on with it, which um, I must be careful now. in a stealth game is not always the best policy, but oh, there's a, there's a um, customer there. We'll just jump on him and say hello. There we go. Cool. Thank you for playing. Just have a lie down and a rest now. The Temple of Amun. Okay, so let's go and climb some walls. So there's a few guys over there. Cool. So we're going kind of that way. Look at the detail in the walls. It, they must have taken a lot of time and care to just develop this because it just looks sensational. I know I keep seeing it and you're probably getting sick of me seeing it, but I do love it. I do love the overall look of this. I think it's plays nice, looks fantastic. And I like the kind of, um, see I tried to put the ego up there and it, it done a pulse, so animus pulse. Here we go. So let's see if we can find some more people. See there's a lot of people that I've missed here. Just hop down here and we'll um, go and say hello to a few people and see if we can release the farmers. So this will be very familiar to you if you've played Assassin's Creed before because you've got the what has been the straw piles, I guess that's palm leaves or something like that. Um, obviously you've got the long grass and whatnot. And here comes victim number two, and we'll just wait for him to get a little bit closer before we engage. Now, I can see people that I haven't actually been able to flag yet. You see the guy climbing up the wee ladder there. So he's going, oh, what's that? Hello, come and have a seat. There you go. And we'll head out. Oh, some loot. Uh, see. I tried to put the ego up again and just got a pulse. So it's um, it's hit and miss, and I'm finding that a little bit with the controls for the Xbox that sometimes it does what I wanted to do. Sometimes it's not registering. So I'm not sure if that's the way I've got it things set up, or whether that's something to do with the game, or whether I'm not pushing the right buttons. But I'm sure we'll figure it out. It's probably me. <laughs> Let's go and sneak up here. I think there's a guy up here. Yep, there he is. Oh, oh, nothing to see. Unfortunately, we went. Where's he going? He'll come back up and I'll kill him. Here he comes. Oh, bow and arrow. Yep. Hello, have you seen the sword? There you go. Come on. That would do it. Nah, no, I think I've alerted them, so. Yeah, I have an epic feel trying to throw him over the barrier here, but <laughs> never mind. Yep. Drop him off the edge there. 
Come on. Not close enough. Just a little bit closer. My goodness, mate. Get off me tower. That, that should do it. There he goes. See ya. Hey, what? Uh, oh, oh, oh. That wasn't the right move. Yeah, take that. And that. And that. And that. I got two bodies I got to throw off the edge. Hey! <laughs> what? <gasps> That's it, okay. die! Yeah, take that. You can see the uh, the guys with the longer poles are a little bit more tricky to kill. I'm looking, it's funny, not all of these guys can look, so... That's a bit of a change. Ooh, there's another dude up there. Yeah, I need to put the ego up. <laughs> I don't know where the rest of these guys are. There's a few guys I hadn't even picked out. Turning the ego around is a bit of a task. So you have to do kind of wide sweeping arcs. Push it back around. Not a major drama, but I, yeah, I'd expect it to be a bit more responsive. Well, we got lots of people still here that we didn't find. Look at that. I told you that would happen. <laughs> we only have to go down there, so we haven't got too far to, to run, so that's not too bad. Let's take a chance and go and release these farmers and get out of dodge, I guess. They seem to be just down below us here. Yep, just down there. Should be able to get down there without being spotted, hopefully. Is a guy up in the tower here? No. Let's just have a good look around before we do anything. Try and hit this guy. Which is a mistake. No. So you can put the arrows on fire, and what you can do is you can actually set something alight and dis to distract them. <laughs> and you'll see in a quest shortly that I uh, I try that and yeah, it doesn't end well. There you go. Never mind that. Put your bow away. We're going to go and um, rescue these guys. There's nobody really around, so we should be pretty safe. That's fine. Quickly, go! Where is Terra Moon? Ah, oh, they are Moon. He has died from his wounds. His family will want to bury him properly. So that's all right, fellas. You just leave me with the bodies. Poor old Terra Moon didn't make it, unfortunately. Um, so we're going to extricate him back to his family farm so they can give them a decent burial now. <laughs> I um, make a bit of a mistake here because I'll try to take a shortcut and yeah you'll see in a second it doesn't quite work out and I do get a bit discombobulated look there's a big river there um, oops I guess I've got to go the other way anyway I've cut out the kind of five minutes of running around the desert trying to find our way back into Siwa and um, well, it's, uh, it's not too far. You have to go all the way around. So yeah, people were a bit surprised to see me carrying a body. Actually, some people just don't even make any reference. They're just like, oh, okay. 
must happen every day and see what <laughs> Take care, you faithfully follow his command. EY Biox so well liked, he's pretty nimble on his feet, even my body on his back is you know, he gets around a bit, doesn't he? Now you gotta be careful we see these guys this <laughs> I'd never find that stop finding that funny. You just can see a person coming from a mile away. Obviously I've marked those look see. So you gotta avoid those guys. Because if they spot you, they will attack you. So, um, yeah, we'll just hop across the road here. D sorry if I got to look left and right. I spared the highway code, but it's all right. I'll be so. And um, just gonna get back without being spotted, which I do get spotted in a sec. Yeah, I am. Great God, Amun! It is our. <laughs> Somebody seemed to have helped me out there, so we can we'll hop over the wall again in a minute. Uh, as you can see, I just used the strategy of just run away from them. Eventually, they get bored and they'll leave. There's a few of those guys there. So we're getting close to the end, we're nearly there, about 100 metres. So apart from that little set to where they spotted us, it wasn't too bad or too hard. I'm sure that's not always going to be the case. So let's go and talk to the guy at the farm and explain to him what's happened. I bring sad news. Where is Issa? She lies here. With her son and daughter. The entire family? Sadly, I see Terror Moon also paid the price for his recklessness. I warned him that his rebelliousness would bring torment and suffering. But what happened? They saw the soldiers coming and hid in the cellar. But the soldiers burnt the house to the ground to teach everyone a lesson. Ah, I am sorry. Put the body down there. They will journey to the Dua together. So many deaths in the Wahat. We cannot give them a proper burial. It is not your rebelliousness that got you killed, Seni. It is Ptolemy's sick regime. He is a. So here we go, guys. Job done. I hope you've enjoyed this. It's um, I'm really enjoying the game. If you have any questions or any comments, please leave them below. If you want to continue to watch um, Assassin's Creed Origin, uh, I'm going to be putting a whole lot of episodes up on the channel in the coming weeks. So if you haven't subscribed yet, make sure you subscribe and we will catch you next time.